Hello and welcome to a update, another update for my North York Moors layout in O-Gage. Uh, this is January 2022. Um, not much has been going on. I've run out of materials and I'm still waiting for things to arrive that was ordered over the Christmas break. But let's have a look what we have been up to. And uh, I can show you where we've been progressing. So this spur from the last video has now got its ballasted down. As we go along, this leads down to my uh, TMD that we're working on. Um, at the end of this spur, there's a my fueling point with fueling grids. I got these from uh, Railway Laser Lines. Let's just get focused there. Uh, there's my fueling point. There's my fuel storage tank. I've been working on. Uh, basically just bought a cylinder and adapted a lot of it myself. The stairs, the railings. It's all scratch built. Just the tanks factory there's not much happened in the engine shed i'm waiting for materials to add some detail to that uh, the 08's moved it's now taking up residence in that corner and i ballasted the two siding tracks for the my coaching stock so i got these done before christmas so I'll move my coaching stock down there out of the way. Uh, what else have we done? Now there's a level, I put a level crossing in. I don't know if this was on the last video. But I built a level crossing and put that there. So that's that's where we're up to with the, my TMD right now. Now on to Gothland Station. Prior up to Christmas I was working on the main station building. This is about as far as I've got. Uh, the bay window is giving me a little bit of trouble. But it should come good in the end. Uh, not much else has taken place on Gothland Station. So that's where that is sitting. Now if we start at, we'll start at Levisham station, signal box, some fencing's gone in, uh, the way bridge building is in with the way scale, bit of cobbling on the entrance and I decided to reduce the size of this yard. This stone wall and five bar gate are not prototypical to Leatherham Station. I decided that the length of board was too much. So I'm planning on just creating a gravel road down to the shed and I think I'll grass the rest and put a couple of grounded van bodies in the field. Now we've got some fe and the back scenes had some work. We've got the fencing off the rear platform. Greenery, the semaphore signal's gone in, and the engine shed you'll remember from the last update. I don't believe this yard was this far advanced. I know the water tower wasn't painted in the last video, which it is now. Uh, not much else is going on regarding this back corner. So pretty much that's all I've actually done in the last couple of months. Not very much. Here's the work in progress from the backside of Gothland Station. 
bit of a challenging build uh, with it being on two different levels. That's probably why it's taken me a while to get it so I'm happy with it. And then panning around, that's about all we're up to. So I hope you enjoyed this little, uh, this short video and this little look into where it's up to at the minute. And uh, hopefully I can advance it a lot more in the next couple of months when I get some more materials. So thanks for watching and I'll see you all on the next update. Bye for now.